Whoa, Steph, what are you doing in Xi'an, man? Let's hang out, get some dinner, some dim sum. Some dim sum sounds really nice with you, man. That would be uh, that'd be pretty awesome to uh, you know meet you out here if you're if you're uh, in town. But if not, then we'll catch up some other time. So right now we're gonna go to some tall uh, wall that Mark knows about, and then ooh, little treats here. Now we're going to, like I said, we're gonna go to some wall and see the sun set from that wall. Uh, yeah, Steph, if you're in town, let's link up, see what's good, and get some tea. That's what they do here, they drink tea. I love tea, tea's so good. This place is ginormous. Oh my life. I'm just gonna lift up my camera really quick. Check that view out right there. Look at that bad boy. We're gonna spin it all the way around. Spin it, spin it, spin it, spin it. Bada bam, bada boom. Now that's a view if I have ever seen one in my life. Fantastic. We're on top of this Xi'an wall and it's gorgeous. It's so big. I'll tell you it's cold. I'm, my hands are freezing. So I'm gonna say it's probably 38 degrees right now outside. Every, almost every single person has a jacket on, just the way it is. So it's, it's cold. Jacket, jacket, everybody's got a jacket on. I'm glad I brought this with me, because it's chilly. All right, I got a few minutes while these guys are going in and getting some money from the China Construction Bank. So we just got off of the Xi'an Wall. It's like the ancient wall of this city. And what my brother told me was that Xi'an used to be the capital of China for thousands of years before Beijing. I got to fact check that one but that's what he told me. And now we're gonna go try to find some food to eat because we are famished. That wall was massive. It was huge. It was really nice. Everything here is immaculate. There is nothing on the ground. You could lick the ground. That's how clean it is. This place is darn nice. So Beno bought a uh, cappuccino, and as you can tell, I uh, got a little bit there. So I'm just gonna leave it there. It's probably gonna uh, annoy some of you, but that's all right. That's what I do sometimes, I annoy people. Right now we're gonna walk around this uh, Goda, Bagoda, Bag Bagata, something like that. I don't know what it's called. So this is the culprit of my mustache, of my white mustache. It's that was, good. It's, is it good? I liked it, it's very good. It's yeah. very good, very sugary. Caramel? Yes. Compe caramel frappe. Mmm, so good. Everybody's out here just dressing up in outfits and it's interesting. I think it's like a traditional Chinese thing, but it's um, it's one of those things that I've just gotten uh, used to already. We're getting to the food, slowly walking. Here's another hyperlapse for your enjoyment. find food. Another point that we were gonna make was that you need to spend at least I'd say a solid four days just in this city in order to experience everything from terracotta warriors to the towers to the wall to everything uh, that is worth seeing. This is a lot. Is there 
enough lights. We are in the back alley of Xi'an. <laughs> this is, wow, uh, look at that lighting. Man, if you want to film, this is the place to film it. And to Xi'an we are. I'm gonna turn around and do the same thing this way because it's so big. Wow. It's so bright. These lights are so loud. Loud? Loud. These lights are so, so loud. All right, I keep forgetting to turn the microphone on, so I'm gonna use the microphone from, hopefully from now on. I got myself a pomegranate drink from uh, one of these pomegranate stands. Now we're heading back towards the main city because we couldn't find any food that these guys wanted. So I just grabbed myself some dumplings. A leaf just fell on me. Beep, beep. Beep, beep. Beep, beep. Beep, 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 They got spices. They got jewelry. Little tiny pigs. Shops. Just a ton of stuff. And then they got a bunch of these motorcycles just in the middle of this walkway where everybody's walking down. It's crazy how lively it is at, it's 7.55 p.m. right now. And this place is popping. Oh, nice. We're right in the middle. Why couldn't we have done this yesterday? This is great. We took a wrong turn yesterday, so now we've gotten back ourselves back onto the Xi'an wall. I don't know how much longer I can stand in here. It is so loud. Uh, yeah, I'm out of here. This is way too loud for me. I can't, I can't deal with this. You know what I've realized? is that this city is beautiful. It is gorgeous, morning or night. It's obviously much louder during the day, but at night it's peaceful, quiet, relaxing. It's so peaceful. <laughs> this view is absolutely incredible. Yeah. We're making it happen? Yeah. All right, let's make it happen. And what I also wanted to say is that you can ride a bike on the wall, all the way around the entire thing, but we're only doing half of it because we only have an hour left and it takes about an hour and a half to do the entire thing. We're just gonna do half the wall. <laughs> Hello there, good day mates. We're here in the sand wall on our beautiful bikes here. Oh, my knees. Oh, my knees are done. There's a view for you all. This is the other side of the Xi'an wall. We ended our bike ride only halfway around the city because it's just, it's it's too big and we don't have enough time. So now we're gonna head back to the hotel, pack our stuff up, and we're gonna head to the airport. Let's go, let's go. Cars waiting for us. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs>
the joys of traveling, there's a few modes of transportation that allow you to travel to many places. And we are getting on an airplane. Uh, before that, we were on a car. And before that, we were on a bicycle. And before that, we were walking. So there's a few modes in this world of travel, of moving. Right now, we're about to get in the air again and go to some town where there's going to be a big park with a bunch of rocks. So, but in order to get to those rocks, we got to fly to those rocks from this airport here. Very clean. Everything is very clean in this in this city, even in this country. Everything's huge. It's just, it's all massive. And I am immensely impressed at how proper everyone is, how polite. Sometimes things are a little bit loud and some things are a little bit quiet. Right now, this is, this is doable. I like the noise level of airports. It's nice. Baby, let's do this! I'm all the way in the back. That's what I'm talking about. This is my joy to be in the back of the plane. I gotta see everybody. So we've, we've made it on Air Chang'in. And our flight is to Tongren. And uh, I hope nobody's gonna sit here. Because that would be 